I just want to speak on uh, something, and uh, this is kind of a, a bit personal, but I'm going to uh, go ahead and just like send out a little bit of my family history here, and it is that <clears throat> my original name is Edward Driver, so... Basically, with my original father, my blood-related father, <clears throat> he was abused as a small child, and uh, that basically brought up a a generational curse, I guess, where he then abused me as a child, got arrested for drug charges and stuff, and I was then in a foster home. And I was attempted to be adopted until my mother later took me back. And with my stepdad. So, I'm not going to throw any names here other than the last name. And, <clears throat> so my name is Driver. Okay, my dad, Scott Driver, or Scott, I think Scott Gerard, right? So... The, the name Driver comes from his grandparents. So his grandparents are my great-grandparents. This means... Okay, so also, I'm, I'm not sure if I said this yet, but... Uh, I'm not sure if I said this yet or not, but basically the grandparents of him took him away from his original parents because... The abuse that they treated him with, uh, his parents later k killed themselves, and <clears throat> uh, he later became a drug addict and blah 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 blah. But if his parents did not take him and then put him under the name of Driver, then my name would be. My name would be Edward Gerard, basically. Okay, so the person that tried to adopt me at the foster home, um, it's not been 100% proven, but the guy, the stepdad that I live with, has said that the woman's name was Miss Starr. So, if I was taken with her, I would probably be named a whole other different name, but the last name would be Storr. So, Edward Storr would be my last name if I was with that person and if my mama did not take me back, basically. Another thing is, I live and I was born and raised in Jacksonville, Florida. <clears throat> the, the lady that tried to adopt me took me all the way to Orlando, Florida. So this means that if C succeeded to adopt me, I would be in a whole other family uh, with two siblings because I heard that C has two other kids. And basically, I would be living in uh, Orlando, Florida instead of Jacksonville, Florida. Again, though, my name would be Edward Starr or her other name with the last name Starr. So, <clears throat> if his if my dad's parents did not take me in, no, if it, if my dad's no, if my dad's grandparents, I'm I'm getting a little bit of this stuff because I'm 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 like I got some mental mental stuff going on and I can't really concentrate that well. But if my parents' grandparents did not take him in from his parents, my original name would be intended to be Edward Gerard. <clears throat> and if I was blood related to my stepdad, m my name would basically be Edward Hit. No, wait, Edward Hickman. Edward Hickman, or something like that. But I just want to stand by the point of a true fact in life that the smallest things can make the biggest changes.